All right, I'm excited to be joined by uh, Nick Gonzalez, who's heading into his senior year. How's it going, Nick? Pretty good. How are you? I'm doing good, man. Doing good. Enjoying uh, the what I'm hoping are the last few days of the stay-at-home orders here before everybody gets to go back to a little bit of a of a schedule. So um, I'm sure you guys I like. Are I like the, uh, the facial hair you got going. Man, I tell you what, I, I, uh, I, I'm getting sick of it. I got to shave it. It was a good start. I, I you know, I, if I had known when it was going to be, you know, essentially on lockdown for nine weeks, I probably wouldn't have started it. But now I'm no quitter, so I got to take it right to the end. I've tried. It's just I don't think my face is meant for a beard. It just doesn't yeah. really. Well, according to my wife, neither is mine. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, all right. So, um you're from Miami and, you know, and you go to school in D.C. And it's really like, you know, you kind of both places are home, I think, for you. Um, so what city has the most sports teams, D.C. or Miami? Uh, I think Miami does. Okay. Just because they have, I mean, I know both have football, basketball, baseball, uh, hockey, right? Mm -hmm. Does DC have hockey? Yeah. Oh yeah. Captain, um, yep. And then the one that popped into my head was soccer, but now I remember that they both have soccer. I'm I'm gonna say I don't have this officially, but I'm gonna say if we count the XFL from this That's past right. year, then DC wins by DC one. DC wins. DC yeah. wins. All right, you got me on that one. Um, all right. So I saw this semester you took uh, guitar as one of your classes. What is your favorite song to play on the guitar? Favorite song to play on the guitar? There's a few. Um, I'd say maybe uh, Hold On by John Lennon. Okay. It's a good, good, That's little, a good one. little song from his single albums, yeah. Yeah. Did you learn that just for the girls? Like, you know, you got to have a I, I, I like the groove to it, you know, okay. so I... Yeah, you know, quarantine it had me learning a bunch of new songs, so yeah. I learned that one and I really enjoyed it. So yeah, good deal. Okay, let's take a flashback to uh, the trip to Methodist. Okay. Okay. Who was your roommate on that trip? Do you remember? Wow. Wow, that was a while back. I know, um, and and the reason I ask is because you may not have slept a wink on that trip if, if he was your roommate. Oh my God, Brian Millar. <laughs> yeah, is he the well, loudest guys, scorer ever? You guys paired me up with him quite a few times this year. I know. I mean, great kid, great. Kid. I love him. I love him, but he does snore quite a bit. You know. I might have to put a stipulation into our room contracts that he has to get a single or something. I don't know because. I just, I just hope I'm not paired up with him for training camp or anything like that. Oh, yeah, he's brutal. Awesome. Okay. Uh, what's your favorite go-to restaurant when you're in D.C.? Restaurant? Either Alero or uh, this place called uh, Kafuku, and it's like a Japanese place. Really Where's good that? ramen and stuff or like something? It's right when you get off on the metro from Chinatown. Okay. Yeah. Okay. In China, it's yeah. right there. Yeah. Hard to go wrong in Chinatown. Good, good stuff. Yeah. yeah good deal. All right. Last question is the one I ask everybody. What's something positive that you've learned that kind of surprised you during this time? Something positive that I've learned is uh, I don't know. I feel like this this whole quarantine on my own kind of thing made me like really uh, self disciplined in seeing that I couldn't go to the gym, that I couldn't do all this. I had to kind of tweak things into like. Uh, and modify things that will work for me. And I did that a lot, um, you know, to building um, you know, like weights and stuff like that in the backyard to, you know, this whole internship process and all that, yeah. you know, it's like a lot of on my own kind of thing. So it's cool, like, uh, you know, growing up or something. Just, like that. Yeah, I, I think that's pretty awesome. Just finding a way in a time where everybody says, don't do this, don't do that. You're like, well, I got something because you're a guy like we have to throw you out of the athletic center. You're in the weight room every day and I can't, you must be Jones and to get back in there. Yeah. The gyms now in Miami are supposed to open up soon. So I'm pretty excited about that. Okay. Good deal. So we'll see. Yeah. Well, that's great stuff, man. It's good to see you. Coach. Always good. Yeah. All right. I'll talk to you soon. All right. Stay Sounds good, coach. Appreciate yeah. it. See you.